So a, a prophet will do his own. But by the time you become political, now you start seeing you with, uh, is that the way they say Elijah? <laughs> with uh, kings, King Ahabu, taking photograph and all of that, you know. All of this thing, this is not the way God sent us. Eh, prophets are supposed, to, are supposed to be living in the wilderness, in the bush. Or even where they are in town, they just deliver their deadly prophecy. Not that they will die, people will die. When you say deadly, that means this prophecy. If it's good, you are lucky. If it's not good, then you have you have problem. Oh, oh so let's ask your of Christ not what people are. And Oshofa. <laughs> Oshofa, ah, Oshofa is an embodiment of Jesus Christ. Oh my God. Oh my God. If you know that man, anybody that knows Oshofa, you don't even want him to die. Anytime I see him in dream, I continue to cry. Why did you leave us, Papa? The way you left us, see where we are. A, a Sunday after they have done their Thanksgiving, they didn't know. He told them, I've seen flowers. I, I see myself living where there are plenty of flowers, this and that and that and that and that. He placed his hand on his head and said, God, take me away. For three, day, for three days that he was there, he was still warm. I have a shepherd that was staying, that was part and parcel of that place. That's how they are unable to say whether he's dead, whether he's still come back or not. But that night, he finally departed. Somebody who has an ulcer saw, uh, that, that, a, a saw that doesn't heal. He saw Papa moving around, touching every bed in that uh, church. And he received, she was a matron in Lut. She received that, that labial. Yes, she she received healing. Everybody in that hospital that night they said what they saw, and it, 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 it's almost the same thing. How he was touching beds. That is such a far. Even in that, he was walking wonders. In 1982, I remember when Oshof, Papa Oshofa was invited to uh, uh, Deeper Life. You mean it's ah. Deeper Life, okay. Uh, let Baba Depoye, Baba, Baba, uh, Deeper Life is still around, uh, Kumuyi, yes. he's still alive. Yes, still I was with him. And that's another man of God, too. And I pray that he will still live long. Let him go and ask what happened. And what Oshofa told them, they said that place is not a church. <laughs> Papa said, I see a church. Filled with multitude of people like sons of the beach. When they want to collect off a tree, off a tree, they said, no, we don't do that. Ah, he said, you'll be collecting it here. Are they not collecting it now? When he was talking, the spirit of God came into everybody, including Baba Kumui. Go, Papa, Papa, they boys go and ask. Be their, their, their colleagues in the in the vineyard of God. He should go and ask. The police in can and PFN, sir. In the vineyard of God, for whatever God can or no can, in the vineyard of God, their colleagues. He should ask, who is such a far? He came to your church. What happened? How did you see him? Then he should go back to God and ask, who Oshofa is. 
Are you saying that maybe Babadi boy maybe is a bit spiritually blind or something like no, that? No, no, no. I won't say that. That'd be too rude. Okay. Sir. I won't say that. Because if no, 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 I won't say that. Won't say, sir, because you say that no, 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 no. Okay. Anybody can can say certain things. And like I said, flesh. We are not hundred percent spiritual. We don't have hundred percent spiritual body. We have a uh, part of it. Because as. people will be asking that someone like Paddy Boy is advanced. I mean, it's this advanced, is advanced, but it's yeah, not hundred percent spiritual body. That's what we should realize. So don't, don't let's stop judging people from what they say. Even if it may be a trap for you. To, to speak evil against the man or be rude against the man, and then we will see something to campaign against you before God. So you have to be careful. You have to be in spirit. Mm. Mm. So while I was telling this to them in the church, they said the spirit of evil is using me. <laughs> I said, okay, oh. Uh, well, me, I don't know, but what I know is that the spirit, Holy Spirit of God is using me. And uh, I've, I've prophesied, and I moved on. How it comes to be or not to be, it's not my making. You have been used as a vessel. I've been used, so, and I leave. So how, what I said, if actually I am a prophet of God, then whatever is spoken through me, like the Bible said, will come to pass. Because it said, none of my word will return back to me void until it has to feel that which I send it to accomplish. That's what the Bible said. When Buhari wanted to come in 2014, Father Mbaka is a respected, I respect him too, uh, Father Mbaka of the uh, of, uh, uh, Catholic Church. Uh, yes, of, uh, uh, they call it uh, something like that. Uh, adoration. <laughs> then he was still saying, Jonathan, we return as president. But since May, 2014, the law has been telling me, and I sent some, some, uh, some, uh, some uh, 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 messages to the now Minister of Information, Lai Mohammed, Alaji Lai Mohammed, that this is what I saw, this is what I saw, this is what I saw. He has not become Minister then, but I met him where I used to buy my suits then. That's uh, Bevistas. That's why I buy my suits. I met him and we discussed because I love his write up while they were still in ACN. Yeah. Then, by December 2nd, Tuesday, December 2nd, 2014, I did a full page advert. Father Mbaka has not still maintaining Buhari will come in. Jonathan will come in. Jonah, sorry, Jonathan will come in, not Buhari. <laughs> But December, Tuesday, December 2, Punch newspaper. Go and look at Punch newspaper, December 2nd, 2014. I came out with a full page advert and uh, advertised that Puari is, what, is who God chose, 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 chose for Nigeria. But the problem is, in that message, it was clear. Let him go there and, uh, and, and reign, not rule. But when you come there, the people surrounding, the people that have offended you, you start all of that. People should be investigated. But whether they have offended in the past, you will during military take over, all of that and that. God has brought you there because God loves him. Go and reign. Do not rule. Is there in that uh, in that prophecy? It was in January. Father Bakada came out that Buhari will win. You know, Jonathan now uh, postponed the rescheduled the election in February. Yes, and too much. Too much. So this is a matter of May 2014. Until when I brought it openly in the, I still have everything in my phone. The one I sent to Alaji Lai Mohammed. Hmm. To December 2nd, Tuesday. But how are you able to see it? But it's the voice of God. Mm. All this one I'm saying now, the voice of God told me, go and educate people about who Oshofa is and about what Celestial Church of Christ is. Mm. Right now with Buhari's own now, with the level he has gone after five years, how will you rate him now as a well, prophet of I'm God? Rating, you know, I delivered the message and I moved on. If, uh, like, so politician, I'm not a politician. There was a, t sorry, I have to say, I was in the office of uh, 
the now uh, it was go he was governor before he became governor. There is now minister of interior, but uh, uh, Ralph. I was with some people that are still alive. Three of us together inside his uh, conference. Uh, I got there. They seized my land somewhere in Lagos, <laughs> and I want to tell him, please let me tell the governor then. No, was the governor then that. This one, I got this one through the CTLS and the bonus I was getting from my office because I retired with Federal Land Revenue Service. I never received query there. And nobody queried me for mismanagement of fund or anything. And I don't bear for posting. It's not my life. I won't do it because the moment you do it, anything happens, you will be in trouble because you are the one who begged there. They should go and check my record. Is there? That's why I'm saying it openly to the world. I retired from Federal Land Revenue Service. Hmm? Yeah. So. Of Ralph. Yes, and I told him, ah, sir, the case, this appeal at uh, Ilone will fail. But the way it will fail is that it will see, you will still be governor. But we fail for this one, go, 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 go. Anyway, and, and he said, if it's the God that is serving that has said, told me that, that this one will not fail. I said, sir, what I came here for is a different thing, though. To appeal to you, to help me appeal to some people, to return my land. <laughs> but, you see, I'm not in Sutana. I was in a suit, serial suit. <laughs> serial suit, too. No be suit of uh, 200,000, oh. <laughs> I'm telling you the truth. And then I go to Bevista, they know me there. So, uh, and I don't steal. Who will I steal from? Because if you don't like trouble, the time I was taken to federal record <laughs> that uh, I spoke about this church and all of that, somebody to, ah! I said, me? 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 Appearing like a criminal <laughs> in my life? Federal record? But I thank God for that judge and for God that <laughs> he didn't allow the, 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 the plan of devil to manifest. If not so, you have been remanded in prison and you have become a prisoner be that too. So to God be the glory. But truth, I will continue to say. But God of truth will continue to support me. So the people in the church, they are even the problem of the church. Because if, if you are doing things that are wrong, and you see somebody telling you, are you not supposed to change? Yes, sir. Yes. Sir. Are you supposed now to go and, 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 and uh, I said, because I said, people are becoming too fetish in the church. Uh, they are this and that. Uh, they are now this and that. But people start in, misinterpreting it. Even in some of them, I say we, even including myself, because I don't want to exonerate myself from the problem of the church. Mm -hmm. But yet, they still see me as said, but I'm not the enemy. They, they were not enemies. If I see them tomorrow, I will see, greet them, if we move closer. Because you don't need to create enemy. Just say the truth. Give the prophecy and move. But at the time, prophecies can be harmful to the third party. But at the end of the day, that case, they, they, they threw it back to the first court of uh, uh, the, the tribunal. <laughs> they now call me from there. They I want to talk to with Yogbeni. Uh, I said, not necessary. I gave him my card that day. I didn't collect his number. It's not because I was rude or Igbiraga or proud. You know, because you see, you have to be careful when God uses you. And God doesn't talk to some prophets all the time. It's when he tells you, you recognize the voice, and you go and do it, and it will come to pass. That is one of those examples. You see? And when I now travel to Ushubu, I stayed in that court, attended the first sitting with them. I sent two nights, three nights, two nights three, with my money. I didn't collect money from anybody. And I attended that first sitting second. I said, this is the period where you will say true. Hmm. I said they should tell him because they called him. At Uchugbo. I slept in Oshugo. I was still working then. I left my office, went there. And they, and they told him because I was there in the outside. They told him that. And they won. Did I because of that say, Governor, ah, JB, I predicted so, so, so. No. He, he would call you to say thank you. No, he, he, because he didn't even have my number. Maybe if he had had my number, I would have said, okay, okay. But the person who took me there too, I don't know what happened, well, something like that. So at the end of the day, he became the governor. Mm -hmm. And he now even became minister. So a, a prophet will do his own. 
But by the time you become political, now you start to you with, uh, is that the way they say Elijah? <laughs> with uh, kings, King Ahabu, taking photograph and all of that, you know. All of this thing, this is not the way God sent us. Eh, prophets are supposed, to, are supposed to be living in the wilderness, in the bush. Or even where they are in town, they just deliver their deadly prophecy. Not that they will die, people will die. You. When you say deadly, that means this prophecy. If it's good, you are lucky. If it's not good, then you have you have problem. Oh, God has sent you to say it. <laughs> so, but you have to say it. So that's the way it is. So, so let's ask us of Christ, not what people are, and Oshofa. <laughs> Oshofa, ah, Oshofa is an embodiment of Jesus Christ. Oh my God. Oh my God. If you know that, man, anybody that knows Oshofa, you don't even want him to die. Anytime I see him in dream, I continue to cry. Why did you leave us, Papa? The way you left us, see where we are. But he has to go now. He's working with angels. But uh, he says something. There was a, 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 a hymn read that through him. Bi bo ba ye di te mo wa, mo bo do te ri ba fun olu wa, e ni o mo i jo mi mo, e di de ke ni olu wa. Alleluia ni o ni wa, Alleluia wa ni no i she wa. Bi a ye fe, bi a ye ko, mo te ri ba fun Christi. That's a very profound one. I think. Why what? Oh, yeah. We need to be prepared. Again, sorry. Need to be prepared. Hmm. Also, my first thing, Papa, in December. Papa entered through some prophets. One in us, and another prophet, and very tall prophet. I don't want to mention his name, and he's very small boy. Even that accident, Papa, did he die in the accident? He didn't die in the accident. He went to Labi Hospital. He even took him to a battle from a battle to that. He didn't even die. Maybe few scratches. No internal injury. Yeah. The day he died in the hospital, go and ask. The day yeah. he gave, why did he give up? He gave up because some of his uh, 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 Mark. And uh, Mark and, uh, I've forgotten the name of this one. Uh, Mark, you know, they always follow him. Mark and uh, they, 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 they have died, but they, they didn't tell him. You will see it in this uh, place. They didn't tell him. Then he knew, he later, he later he, he, because he was asking, where is Mark? Where is uh, the other person? His son Ebenezer said somebody mistakenly jived during a meeting. You, not mistakenly. Okay, Oshofa is Oshofa. <laughs> By the time he looks at you, what you don't want to say? You will start saying it. And that one says, say, you know what? Papa now retorted. Okay. They will say, I am killing these people so that I can be alive. A, a Sunday after they have done their Thanksgiving, they didn't know. He told them, I've seen flowers. I, I see myself living where there are plenty of flowers, this and that and that and that and that. He placed his hand on his head and said, God, take me away. For three, day, for three days that he was there, he was still warm. I have a shepherd that was staying, that was part and parcel of that place. That's how they are unable to say whether he's dead, whether he's still come back or not. But that night, he finally departed. Somebody who has an ulcer saw, uh, <laughs> that, that, a, a saw that doesn't heal. He saw Papa moving around, touching every bed Jesus. in that uh, church. And he received, she was a matron in Lut. She yeah, received, that that, that. yes, she, she received yeah. healing. Yeah. Everybody in that hospital, that time, they said what they saw. And it, it, it's almost the same thing. Yeah. How he was touching beds. That is such a far. Even in death, he was working wonders. How many among those people by helicopters, uh, train, and uh, uh, railway, and uh, everything. Uh, how many dead bodies have they raised? Why they were even alive? When they will be gone? When they will be gone? When they didn't raise or do those serious miracles? Anybody can do. Even, even me that's talked to you here, yeah? I do some little, little miracles now. Mm -hmm. eh? So, you see? But now, where Papa now left, 
when he was to be buried. <laughs> August, uh, uh, October 19, he want to be, they want to bury him the December. He now came to the point where why are you delaying my body? Because they are expecting me. That's why they now rush to bury Papa Oshofa. That October 19. And what I discovered was that when it was quarter to three, there's sun, there's moon, apart from the stars. And that uh, before Imeko, at, uh, at uh, City Hall, you know the fountain that has been dead. Not that they repaired it, too. it came to function because they are bringing, they want to lay Papa uh, in state there. Started function. And rainbow came inside it. People draw the whole water, <laughs> they draw it finish. Now, at Imeko, what happened? I saw it, I saw it my eyes, so nobody told me story. This is Emmanuel, Prophet Emmanuel, Abiodun Shoyemi, son of his true father. I saw it with my eyes, not that the people tell me stories. Now, what happened? Sun and moon, quarter to three, when they are about to lower him. Because they have to lower him, three o'clock, dot. Once it's three o'clock, moon and sun, they touch each other by the side. And immediately they are lowering the casket, the body. Shava. The sun, now, the rays of the sun, you will see it from heaven penetrating, following the body down to the, to the side of the grave. Shiba. As you see a touch light in the darkness, the way the rays will go in the dark, that is a, that, if anybody say that's not what happened, let that person come and face me. Okay, I will tell you something. They should go and investigate. Sketch newspaper carried it. They, famous sketch newspaper. Sketch, sketch. If it's not, uh, if it's not, uh, if it's not dead now, they should go and check. Uh, papers carried it, but I know of that uh, sketch because somebody brought the sketch to me. You know, we didn't buy. We are there at Imeko. We are, we are, we are in serious sad mood. That uh, we are not happy. You. It was only 76, just ordinary 76 years. He, they gave him the church while he was 38 years. He led the church for 38 years, he died. And you are still telling me, power of woman, which woman? Eh? See the race. Go and find out sketch. Sketch. Maybe that should be sketch October 2021, 22. It's after that event. It's reported. They should go and to the archive and see what happened. Pope could identify that this is a man of God, and Baba, uh, Baba Kumuyitu said, and many people said, even Baba Lawo said. So, where is it? Is using power of woman, women. So, power of women was the one who manipulated what came from above. Even during Baba Bada's burial, too. See what happened. Many things happened from heaven. Same day they were doing him. I was part of the people who carry Baba Bada now. So why will anybody that has the spirit of God talk evil of celestial church? Before nobody says hallelujah. Nobody says hallelujah. We are no ranger when we say hallelujah. Yes. But then when they wanted to start, they start with uh, hallelujah. If you know this prayer, hallelujah. What does it mean? What is the difference hallelujah, hallelujah? Wait, let me finish, no? Hallelujah, hallelujah. They started with hallelujah. Later now, they are now chanting hallelujah, better than <laughs> Celestia. They are even chanting 21. We are chanting seven. Go and look at the record. I said before there was no, those early 80s, there's something like uh, hallelujah. They don't say hallelujah. But in around 90s, they started hallelujah. This Pentecostal Celestial Church is the Pentecostal Church. Is the, is the real Pentecostal Church. Any other show that says Pentecostal, they are trying to uh, imitate. Because what is Pentecostal? You see that in Acts 2 now. And then it will tell you, gift of prophecy, speaking in tongues, this and that. That's what Celestial is. A show that is like that is Kerubu and Seraphim. And the Church of the Lord. Aladura. But Celestial is king. What's the difference between Hallelujah, Hallelujah, and Hallelujah? Well, Hallelujah is uh, praises mm. to God. 
and he gives victory when you praise God. Now that's the language of heaven. Okay, I will tell you about Idahusa. Bishop Idahusa came to Bababada. Oh, blessed memory. Both of them are of blessed memory. No, Idahusa started this Pentecostal thing. No, he started it in Benin with uh, this uh, Ayo Orisha Jeffo, <laughs> who is, was his assistant then. Then what do I want to say about this? He said he was in a dream, a vision. Then he ascended. And when he got there, he saw people robed in white apparel garments. He now said, man, eh, may I have the opportunity of this? Ah, I thank God, do praise the Lord. Do. Nobody answered. It was he was said it by himself to Pastor A. A. Bada, Biodo, Alexander Biodo, Bada. The second time said, maybe they didn't hear well. Pray, he now used to say, praise the Lord. Nobody answered. Ah, he now, he now remembered that there's a church where he was coming from. Oh, they used to shout, hallelujah. Oh. They, they too, they are in white, uh, Sultana. Maybe that's uh, the people I'm seeing here. He now shouted, Ale, before he said, Lou, the whole heaven roared in hallelujah. He came to tell Baba Bada, this is your hallelujah. That's, this is your hallelujah. Ha, it's something, though. This is what I saw. That's Bishop Idahusa. People can go and investigate. You know, people cry, criticize what they don't know. You know, Peter said they criticize uh, Paul's writing because they don't understand it. That's what the uh, Apostle Peter said. Then another one is Baba Obadari, Prophet Obadari. Late Patimoti Obadari. He said he had a, a vision. He saw a river. People like pigs, dirty, they will go inside that river. Then, when they will cross to the other side, they will be clean as anything. Then they will be robed with white apparel. Ah. He was jolted back. Say, what is the meaning of this? What kind of river is this? He was told that it's a church. Say, what church is this? It's a celestial church. Eh? Why did you give me celestial church to go and uh, pastor? They now told him, we have given you the one you will pastor. That one was given to that to another person. Pastor, uh, Prophet Obadari said it to Pastor Obadari. It was not lie, it's the truth. Baba Bada told us everything at one of our gardens on Good Friday while we were all fasting. We do fast. But because some people have messed up the, the purpose of this church, that's why everybody will say whatever they like against this church. But this church is not a church, and Oshawa is not somebody that people will just talk rashly against. You see? So all of this, that's the way I see it. But you see about Celestial Church, let me go to Revelation, Revelation 2. I will read one. Revelation 2, so that I can save our time. Time is fast spent. Revelation 2. If you look at this Revelation 2, verse 1, it said, Unto the angel of the church of Ephesus write, This thing said, He that holdeth the seven stars in his right hand, who walketh in the midst of the seven golden candlesticks, Seven golden candlesticks. That's what you see in the cell. Papa read Parmarisis. That's why I say I'm not educated, though. We weren't professors, but she direct professor, whether you are professor of mathematics or professor of uh, economics or professor of uh, science, or whatever. Seven can do, golden can do, six, six. When they mention can do now, they say a court is the one using can do. It's a uh, a court, a court. So even before in Nepal, rechargeable lantern, a lot of that. When Nepal take light, what do we use? Candle. Oh, no con. So because I put candle in my house, then I become a court. 
When they see you using this, they say it's a cult because it's a lesser church. Now, let me go to Revelation 4. He now said, from 1, after this I look and behold, a door was opened, Revelation chapter 4 from verse 1. After this I looked and behold, a door was opened in heaven, and the first voice which I heard was a eat while of a trumpet talking with me. We said, come up hither, and I will show these things which must be hereafter, which must happen hereafter, and which will happen thereafter is the establishment of the golden candlestick, the throne of God among men, which is the celestial church of Christ. Verse 2. And immediately I was in spirit, and behold, a throne was set in heaven, and was sat on the throne. And he that sat was to, was to look upon like a jasper and a sardine stone. And there was a rainbow, rainbow, in which the name of the show was written by Emmanuel uh, uh, Alexander Yanga. Papa Oshofa didn't name Celestial Church of Christ. That's what many people don't know. He was, <laughs> it was the Spirit of God that revealed the name through Alexander Yanga. That's why I said, Papa Deboye should go through this book, ask his PA or whoever to go and get this. It's a constitution, they call it Blue Book, and uh, try to get this one written by Mother Celestial Edith Oshofa. Mm. And round about the throne were four and twenty seats. Upon the seats I saw four and twenty elders sitting, clothed in white garment, raiment. I've never seen in heaven where they say they wear coat, they wear agbada, they wear jacket, they wear booba. <laughs> if, you, if, you, if you if you are there, if you are there, if you are there, you if you are if you happen to be lucky to be there, you wear uh, white what garment or raiment. And they had on their head crown. If you remember what I told you about it, that was uh, yes, what you saw. Yes, and they have on their head crowns of gold. And out of the throne proceeded lightnings and thunderings and voices. And there were seven lamps. Listen, seven lamps of fire burning before the throne. Which are the seven spirits of God? Okay. That's the way seven lights in the candlestick. On the altar. On the altar. That is the throne. Okay. I will go further. And before the throne, there was a sea of glass like unto crystal. And in the midst of this throne, and around about the throne, were four beasts full of fire before and behind. And the first beast was like a lion, and the second beast like a calf, and the third beast had a face of a man, and the fourth beast was like a flying eagle. And the fourth beast had each of them six wings about him, and they were full of fire within, and they rest not day and night, saying, Holy, Holy, Holy Lord God Almighty. That's what we do. It is not by teaching or by person's teaching or theology teaching that this was revealed to Papa Oshofa. They brought this church. Nigbatolu wa sojo mi mo kale, belu wa won ogun oron mi mo. Nigbatolu wa sojo mi mo kale, belu wa won ogun oron mi mo. Olu wa je ka mo wipe, ijo mi mo yiti reni. Ka wa le foni ayo, inya wa ogun oru mi mo. Eh yo, eh yo, eh yo, eh yi ba ba kwe lu ife mi mo. Alleluia, eh yo. Eh yo, eh yo, eh yi ba ba kwa lo yi fe mi mo. Revelation 50, uh, Isaiah 53. I want to run this knob. Isaiah 53, we want to, I want us to go right there. Isaiah 53, verse 1, 2, 3. <coughs> this is an issue. Because if a church is established by Jesus Christ, what was done to Jesus Christ will be done to the same church. If you, like uh, John 14, uh, John 14, 10 up, we tell you that if they do this one to me, they will do the same to you. Yeah. And John 15, 2, <coughs> you see, they will do this one to you. Yeah. Now, if you look at Isaiah 53, who had believed our report, and to whom is the arm of the Lord revealed? For he shall grow up before him as a tender plant and as a root out of a dry ground. He had no form nor comeliness. 
And when we shall see him, there's no beauty that we should desire him. He is despised and rejected of men, a man of sorrows and acquainted with grief. And we hid, we hid as seat while our faces from him. He was despised and we esteem him not. So this, this is Jesus Christ. And when they say celestial church of Christ and descended by Jesus Christ, what else do you expect? I remember Isaac Ogbeta. That was uh, Isaac Ogbeta. That was uh, 19, I think 19, I think 1996 or thereabout. I've forgotten the date now. He belonged to this uh, charismatic uh, movement of this Pentecostal thing uh, in UK. He said they were fasting up and down that celestial church of Christ is a disgrace to Christendom. That they want that church to be for God to kill the church and bury it. Bagwata. The seventh day, you know what happened? What happened, sir? In the vision, Jesus appeared to him. As if Isaac Ogbeta. Ogbeta. Let, let them know Google is there, they will find him or whoever is. He should go and tell them what he saw. He's not a member of the Lesser Church of Christ. That Jesus told him that who told you that church is a, is a demonic church. That church is the church I descended with my blood. Every other church belongs to God. But this only one, like Israel is a nation among men that belongs to God, that is the only church I purchased with my blood. You see? So let everybody be educated about this church. We know we have some uh, miscreants, people that doesn't that doesn't know that Satan has sent to this, uh, into this church to do all kind of stupid things, things that are, are abomination. Yes, they are within us, we know. But God will cleanse his church. Because God will cleanse his church. Between now and the end of 2023, you will see what will happen in this church. Especially 2023. <laughs> Between now and 2023 alone, they will be dying like fowl. They will be shamed like idiots. 2023, they will bury. Go and write it down. The prophet has said his own. Sir, on the last note that uh, a song says, All shofati kushu bon emi rembe. All shofati kushu bon emi rembe. All shofati kushu bon emi rembe. Emi rembe la ye. What advice do you have for celestial members in diaspora? A lot of these people have run out of Celeste into MFM, yes, into Redeem, into Foursquare, and some are even running out of MFM back into their bedroom now because of what they saw in those churches. So a lot of them are confused. Some of them are hibernating at home. Some are even removed the clothes. They've dumped Asha Ogo and they're now watching, uh, wearing Ashwara. What advice, how, and what do you think they should do now, especially in the face of tedious misinformation like the one that came from the quarter that we just mentioned. What do you have for them? Celestians, worldwide, uh, we thank God for Pa S B G Oshofa. We thank God for Baba A. A. Bada. We thank God for this present, Baba Jale Koko. We thank God for this present mm -hmm. pastor, mm -hmm. Reverend Emmanuel Mobin of Friday, Abiodun Oshofa. We thank God, but what I will say is that keep faith Try to be in spirit. Without the spirit, you cannot connect God. You can pray for one million years and start wearing this white everywhere. If it is decoration of a, a, a celebration, you are wearing it for, it will get you nowhere. Lai si e mi, oni ara kuni o, ara bini o, o chikbe mi mi mombi. Lai si e mi, o fo le ni on bere, jesu yo fuo. So be in spirit, worship God in spirit in this church. That's what can connect you to God. And all you want will be given to you. Even the Bible said, those who worship God, they worship him in truth and in spirit. And then no power of the world will overcome you. Because like he said, oh. Oh. 
Won yo ni elia si angelio a won angelio won yo ni no grace a papa o so fa soro kon ni ti eyan ba jo mo ijo mimo bo ku isaju kan kokula ede nu ijo mimo ri yo wa sinu ijo na ibe la ti gbe si odo loro oni be eyan ba nso ojo mo ojo mimo to sinu ijo na titi di oko ojo kan koku to akro ninu ijo na emi si do pin olorun afun gbogbo yin god will give us the spirit to worship till the end Amen. in this church Amen. keep faith with this church but worship god in spirit and in truth don't look at the psychedelic worship and this uh, 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 celebration kind of uh, worship this psychedelic uh, this uh, all this vanity dressing vanity worship worship the way when Oshofa was among us when Babada was among us things were going nowhere because the spirit of God flew in we started doing many things that we all we all and that's why things are not the way they are before so it is not about uh, uh, they are still there, uh, uh, but uh, they are not. But yet we are more. But are we more in carnality or more in uh, in the spirit? That's all we should examine and say. I cannot say anything about that now. That is it. Thank you for this time, sir. And uh, we appreciate your wonderful gesture of trying to analyze the issues and putting uh, the proper perspective in the right places, especially educating Nigerians and the majority of people in the Christian community and in the Celestial Church of Christ fold about the person of Pa S.B. Joshua and try to also educate our father, Pa Enoch Kadija Adiboye, about the misinformation of the ministry of Joshua. We thank you so much and we appreciate this and we wish that next time when we call you to clarify some of this issue, you make yourself very much available, sir. Thank you. Yes, sir. You're welcome. God bless Celestial Church of Christ. God bless every churches in Nigeria in the world. God bless Nigeria and God bless our government. Amen, Till next time that we come about on this program with another special person on issues of religion and especially Celestial of Christ. We want this discourse to continue. Thank you so much. God bless you. Goodbye.